All right, I got the sunglasses off, and um, what we've done is we've taken the timing sprocket off. Dig it. So the gear, the way this goes on, and the way I found out is like if you take the chain off from this direction and then put it back on, it's easiest to go like that. But either way, the way it is is it's got to be bolted. The gear has to be bolted onto this gizmo right here with this straight up. And those lines horizontal and then that's top dead center on the camshaft. It's camshaft and, and the uh, timing drive gear. So don't mess this up. I don't want that getting chewed up or dirty. And just put that there. So that's out in the timing chain. It's being held by this bungee cord here, but we're gonna have to take the head off to regoup the gasket, head gasket needs scooping. And we have to lift the jug up. For that, we're gonna have to take this loose too. We have to lift that jug up as high as we can. And uh, see all the oil in the oil base in here? Probably gonna lose that or drain it down into the oil into back into the engine casing if we can we'll uh, see if we can get a syringe to do that not or a base drain, you know something to suck that oil out and put it down in the casing here so here's the clearance that we're going to talk about on the jugs because you can't lift them any higher than this so here's the gasket on the old one. So this is a good example. See this gasket? It's already fastened on there real tight with some kind of goo. It's not gonna come off. You're not gonna get it off without breaking it. Anyways, this gasket's gotta be regooped. This head's no good, it's cracked. And this is the clearance. So you can only lift it up that high. If you lift it up any higher, then the rings pop out. We don't want the rings popping out of the piston, you know? So we're gonna only bring it up to about here, like just a shy of an inch, three quarters of an inch or something, try to get the goop in the gasket, hopefully. If not, then we gotta, we're gonna have to pull the head, or the jugs completely off to goop the gasket. Then we're gonna need ring compressors. And I don't have the right one, so I'll either have to order them on the internet or borrow them from somebody that's got them. Anyways, so that's it. I'm searching for something to take that oil out. It's trap rig.